In this example, I'm given three whole numbers, and I want to place each of them in the chart. I want to identify then the place value occupied by the digit zero. Let's start with the first number, 25,032. I'm going to line that up with the place value columns in my chart. So that's going to be 25,000, and then a zero here, and three, and then two. So if we want to identify the place value of the digit zero, the digit zero is in the hundreds place. So let's identify that by writing hundreds place. And then maybe let's do an arrow to the zero. Looking at the next number, 105,243. Let's place that in the chart. So my hundred thousands goes here. So it's 105243. If I want to know what place value the zero occupies, let's look in our chart. It's going to be the ten thousands place. So let's write that beneath our number and that is the place value for zero. Looking at the last number, we have 12,340,412. Let's place that into the chart. 12,340,412. The zero is here. It is in the thousands spot, so let's indicate that, and let's write that our zero is in the thousands place.